basically told me the same thing. My jab was landing, my right hand was landing, but my power punch was to the hook to the body, hook to the to the head. Uh, they weren't landing. He was prepared for that probably since the last fight. He knew that these are my strong punches, so he was covering pretty good. Uh, I'm giving I give him credit for the. So like you're basically just starting as a pro boxer, and already you had two fights on on ESPN. Uh, you feel like privileged. I feel privileged. You could say yes that uh, I appeared on ESPN. A lot of us wait a lifetime to appear on ESPN. I appeared on my fourth and fifth fight. I'm really happy. If you see replay on ESPN, well, oh, this topic is a nice topic. Make my fan happy. What I mean, it's a win, five and zero. Oh, that what counts really. And I get uh, over anxious. I get frustrated a little bit. You can see it, and I regret my my act sometimes. It's just uh, a box. Oh, I want to hit him and I can't. And so I get a little bit. Uh, Dirty, if you say, but I didn't so, mean it in a bad way. Do you think with experience you'll be able to get this under control? Absolutely. That, that rage and that... Uh... Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Alright, uh, do you have any other fights scheduled for uh, the next several weeks? Maybe not in the next weeks. Maybe I'm going to take a week or two off. Mm -hmm. I need to stay in shape. I, I, you know, I can't afford to, to go back on a, on a vacation, you know. For the summer, it's going to be in the gym. Working on things that I'm not uh, really... Uh, I need, to, uh, I need to perfect, you know, mm -hmm. on some things, and I'm gonna stay in the gym. Maybe in, in the fall, September, it's gonna be a fight, but there's nothing scheduled yet. Uh, everyone, Anthony, Jean Pascal, Benoit Goulet, Sebastian Goulet, everyone that I was fighting with on the amateur team became professional. I said, oh my god, I was there, you know? It's like you were studying to be a, a lawyer. Uh, so you put on a hole right now to focus uh, completely on boxing? Uh, yeah, I was doing a law school in uh, Université de l'UQAM, right. in Quebec, à Montréal, and uh, I did two years. Um, I was doing good, I was doing good, I was taking a, a part time mm -hmm. and uh, I was doing good now hopefully at the end of maybe 40, 50, whatever my career is, 35, whatever, in my career, there's no age for loss. Alright, just one thing, you got a very big following, like a lot of friends, a lot of uh, yeah. family or friends, I don't know, you, there's always a big crowd yeah. following you. Yeah, since uh, is that added pressure? Of course it's added pressure because uh, Again, uh, my, maybe my last experience, you want to make the crowd happy as much as you want to make yourself happy. So you try to go with the crowd uh, uh, cheering. But uh, since I'm amateur about, my amateur about, they always used to come wherever they are. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Frank. Keep the hard work and let's on the bus. It's been good. Uh. <laughs>